Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to get rid of DFU mode on your iOS device. DFU mode is simply device firmware update mode and sometimes you can get stuck in it, so let's take a look at a few solutions on how to fix that. One way is to root your device. To do this you just have to hold down the home and power button on your iPhone while connected to iTunes until the Apple logo appears on the screen and then simply hit the power button to reboot the device. This trick works for a lot of people but there are some cases where it doesn't, so let's take a look at a few other methods. Another method is inside of iTunes. If you go ahead and connect your device and go to the overview, you can see over here we have a restore iPhone button. If you click on this button, it's going to restore your phone to factory settings. So it's important if you're going to use this fix that you back up your iPhone before you restore it. All you have to do is click on restore and it will be set back to factory settings and most of the time this will fix your issue. And the final method is using iSkySoft iPhone Data Recovery. This is a program you can get offline, and once you've gone ahead and launched it, you can go ahead and connect your device. And then it's going to connect your device to the program, and we're going to go down and click on Fix iOS to Normal. And what this is going to do is bring up some instructions you have to follow, and it's also going to download some firmware onto your device. And once you've completed all of the instructions, which should not take very long, your issue should be fixed, as this feature supports a lot of different problems such as DFU mode, red screen, blue screen, or white screen. And this program makes it really easy to get your device back to the way it should be. And that is it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed. That is how you get rid of DFU mode on your iOS devices. Why are you